as you just saw, my part of my morning routine, I could jump on the scales. I know I have done a morning routine video in the past, but today I decided to do a day in the life. So it's similar, similar to my morning routine video, similar to my full day of eating, but it's going to be everything that I do on a typical day for me. Um, so this morning I've already gotten up and I have taken, jumped on the scales, taken my weight, had my breakfast and it is 8.30 at the moment and I just got off a client consultation call um, and now I'm just getting some social media work done because right away I have their botanics range launch today so I have to post, um, I have to post on there for them. So I took, yesterday I actually did um, a video um, try on haul that I filmed for Instagram TV and then just took some photos. So um, I'm just making sure that that's all good to go. I also have a YouTube video that's scheduled to post tonight, which was, you would have seen it now, it would have already been up, but it was a full day of eating on the go and I took you into my lip injection appointment. So that's pretty cool. I'll update on them. The swelling has gone down quite a lot. And they're looking pretty much looking and feeling pretty much back to normal now in terms of normal filled state normal um, which is awesome and then um, after this I actually have a PT client so uh, I'm going to quickly go and have a shower now and um, get changed into my PT uniform ready to go for that and uh, yeah that's about all I've got to update you on right now my breakfast that you saw me make was my usual my oats protein and nut butter at the moment I'm actually having the ABC's and that is delicious um, ABC standing for almonds Brazil nuts and cashews I believe and that's really yum if you've never had it you need to try it it's super good so um, yeah that's all I've got to update you on right now and um, I'm gonna get this work done, have this shower, and get ready for my day. Alrighty, all done with my shower, and I'm just gonna dry my hair. I'm now in my uniform, and I'm actually going to have my second meal now. It is uh, about 10 past nine, uh, which is a bit early, but uh, after I've got my PT, I come back here, and we actually have a rental house inspection, so I, I'm going to be cleaning for an hour and a half and I don't really want to mess up my kitchen before the real estate agent gets here. Um, but yeah, other than that, have this second meal. I'm going to put it all together now and show you. turkey cooked up ready to go I thought I had it just ready to portion so here I am cooking up a batch of turkey uh, ready to go into this meal that is just beeping in the microwave quickly just put some thick cover on and tied my hair back loosely with a scrunchie it's still a bit wet um, my PT is for half an hour so I'll come back and dry my hair extensions properly but I don't want to do it halfway and have half wet hair so um, a little bit damp is fine. I'm gonna eat this last meal. I'm gonna add the now cooked turkey to the sweet potato and veggies that I've got in there and then I'm off to PT. All right guys, so I'm back from PT now and I'm just about to have my third meal of the day which is actually going to be my pre-workout meal. Um, I have chicken and sweet potato for my pre-workout meal so um, basically with how I meal prep is I make all the different foods that I need and then I put them into containers um, and then I portion it as needed because I work from home I have the ability to do that which is fantastic so I just have all my chicken in here and then a heap of sweet potato that's been cooked up so I'm gonna go ahead and put that all in a bowl and eat that now so after eating my pre-workout meal, I'm just gonna sit down quickly at my laptop while I've got some spare time and reply to a few emails and do a few other little admin little jobs that I have to do. Um, I just have to keep remembering that this is a day in the life, so I have to pick up the camera and show you all the little bits and pieces that I'm doing throughout the day. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna do that now and I'll see you in the next clip. 
All right, guys, so it's about an hour since I had my pre-workout meal and I have done a heap of work on my laptop. I have um, spent a little bit of time. I wrote a my blog for this week, which will actually release tomorrow, but this video will already be out. So I put out a new blog, usually on a Wednesday each week. Um, and this week's blog is about just like a bit of a checklist on how to prepare for a photo shoot, just a few things that I like to sort of remember um, in the lead up to a shoot to do to, so that I'm, I guess, the best prepared I can be so that the photos, um, you get the best outcome out of the shoot in terms of the photos. And uh, I've also replied to some emails and whatnot and I am now going to mix up my pre-workout and head to the gym. I am training upper body today a little bit of carbs, so it'll be carbs, back and delts, and um, I'll try and get some footage of that, but it will depend on how busy the gym is. What time is it? 1.30, so it may or may not be busy. Hopefully it's quiet, and I'll be able to get some footage of me training, but it will just depend on how busy it is. I don't really like pulling the camera out um, and setting it up when um, there are any people around, because the gym's not like overly big, and I just don't like putting it in people's, like potentially putting it in the way of other people. Um, and obviously I'm training on my own, so I like to sort of focus on that rather than having to spend all the time to set my camera up. So probably not gonna get footage, I should probably just say that. Uh, <laughs> so I've got, like I said, carbs, back and delts to do, and then I will do some posing, and I also have one of my hit sessions for the week that I would like to get over and done with. That's what's up. So at the moment, guys, I'm actually using the um, Redcon 1 Total War pre-workout. And I'm also taking acetyl-L-carnitine. I take this first thing in the morning before I train and after I train. So I'm going to put these two in my shaker cup ready to go. Uh, and then head off to the gym. Um, if you're wondering, I get these all of my subs from Spartan Subs which um, their website link is in the description and you can actually use my code Ebony10 to get 10% off if you were wanting that. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and mix this up and then head off to train. All right guys, so I just got back from the gym and I'm in a little bit of a rush as I have, oh, that's a bit dark, as I have another client consultation right now. So I'm gonna do that and then eat my post-workout meal, which is exactly the same as my pre-workout meal. Okay, so my client consultation client didn't answer her phone and we've rescheduled. So I am now cooking up some pumpkin for the meal after my post-workout meal. Um, and I cook everything, literally everything, basically, in the air fryer. So all I did was slice it up and I have, I'll show you, I've thrown it in there. Like that. And I actually, yeah, that should be maybe 15 minutes to half an hour and that should be done. And I'll give it a bit of a toss a few times, just pull it out and give it a bit of a shake. Um, but my, like I said, my post-workout meal is exactly the same as my pre-workout meal. So it's just um, 100 grams of sweet potato and 90 grams of chicken at the moment. And so I'm gonna put that together right now and eat that. The gym was actually so incredibly packed, I can't even explain. It was like so strange for that time of the day, but it was absolutely full and there was absolutely no way that I was going to be filming in there with that many people. So it's it's a really small gym. So when I say it was packed, like 15 people and it's busy, like crazy busy. So um, yeah, definitely not filming that session today. But anyway, that's just how it is. So I'm going to sit down again, eat this meal of mine and do some more laptop work. I've got a couple of clients that I'm going to just do some planning for for their upcoming preps and get that all under control and then um, it'll be time for me to get back into my PT uniform and go to my evening clients. Alrighty guys, so now I am sitting down for my next meal, so my fifth meal of six for the day and it's nearly time for me to head off to my next PT client. But my next meal is a big bowl of yumminess. It is turkey, green veg, sweet potato, and pumpkin 
all mixed into one big bowl so I'm going to sit down and demolish this and um, yeah and then go and get changed ready for work Alrighty guys, so I feel like today's vlog has been very boring because it's just been a whole lot of me talking um, and I didn't really show you what I got up to but that's just the reality. Um, my last PT client cancelled tonight so um, again that's just reality of PT life but I'm about to mix up my last meal of the day and then I'm going to go around and visit uh, my family and I also have some cardio to do so um, I want to go ahead and eat this meal first and then go finish off my cardio because I won't be getting home until later and I just don't want to be eating too late so uh, my last meal is going to be um, veg sauerkraut macadamia oil and steak so as you would have seen in a previous video, it is my favorite meal of the day. It's the mac oil that makes it taste so amazing. So I'm gonna go ahead and mix that up and um, finish out this vlog right here. I may end up picking up the camera tomorrow and just having a sit down chat um, and just giving you a little bit of an update of where things are at with prep. But if I don't, then this will be the final clip. So uh, thank you guys for watching as always, and I'll see you in the next video.